Yeah, kitchen again with Chef Ricardo cooking show guys amazing to be in the kitchen giving your favorite recipes and ideas and things we love to make in a year kitchen I'm saying in year kitchen okay um, I know I get the request many occasions many times about the jerk burger and I said to myself I did a video way back when about jerk burger and all this kind of thing and all this kind of thing and all this kind of thing but anyway we're not gonna go into that we're gonna be making some jerk burger but it's gonna be like the oval style because a lot of people doesn't have access to the burger outside in you know what i mean outside when they can go outside and make some burger or make burger and put it on the grill a lot of people doesn't have access to that so we're gonna be making it that show them how to do the oval style we because we have also once you make it, you can go outside, light the barbecue grill and put it on the barbecue grill outside. You also, you can put it straight in your oven and bake it. And that's the version I want to share with you guys. How to do this one at home in your kitchen and, you know, and in your kitchen and put it straight inside of the oven. So today, recipe is what's going to be happen today with Chef Ricardo. Alright, please stay tuned. Don't go anywhere. And you know what I mean? Please watch the video. And also, please tell a friend and a friend tell a friend. Alright guys, we have the Caribbean Cuisine Cookbook. And as I said, you know what I mean, it's on a special price. Get your copy and tell a friend and a friend tell a friend. Now, what I want to say to you about the, 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 the jerk burger. Alright? A lot of people making jerk burger, but a lot of people doesn't know. You know what I mean? You can't just drop skin and time and bits and pieces and call it spicy and I call it jerk burger. If you make the original authentic jerk sauce for making the bur burger if you notice i have a video on my youtube channel jamaican jerk sauce all right it's, that's the one we've been using all right we're gonna go over here and please the recipe will be on my instagram or my website or my facebook page chef ricardo cook it go over and support me all right Thank you so much for tuning into the show. Got a lot more recipes, a lot more ideas. We'll be coming from Chef Ricardo and the team. And I'm going to be showing you how to make yourself some nice, lovely jerk burger at home. Jerk burger. Ch chuck it straight in the oven, guys. And cook up some burger and share with some salad. Start so got the record of some, some recipe in here. All right. Make sure I get some gloves. Make sure you guys can see. All right. The first thing we're going to do, all right, is... I got some bread right here, which I toast the bread. You can buy bread crumbs at your local shop or your supermarket, but I just toast up some bread and I decide to just, you know what I mean, blend up the bread and use the bread for making that lovely bread crumbs. All right. So all I have to do is just toast some two, a few slices of bread like this, and I'm gonna make a little bit of nice. And I'm just gonna run it through my blender. All right, I eat that. Me just show you what you can do at home. All right, me show you what you can do at home. All right, so this is my beef mince right here which i'm gonna be using to make a few burger all right you can go to your local shop or your supermarket get yourself some mince come on toast two slices of bread and do one middle all right now i'm gonna put the the bread crumbs inside of the nice one guys. so as you can see i just put the mince and the bread crumbs together all right two slices of bread but what i'm gonna do i got Half of a white onion right here, which I want to use. All right, so I'm gonna simply cut it up very finely. You can use white onion, but I'm just gonna be using the red onion, all right? Because I have it and I decide to use it up.
that's the white onion. So I use the red onion. Sorry guys. I use just half of the red onion. See what I'm talking about? That's exactly what Chef Ricardo been talking about. Secondly, I got some mixed herb. I'm gonna put some mixed herb in it, one tablespoon. Alright, so basically as you can see, I just put in the red onion. So what I'm gonna do, I just use red half of a red onion because you know what I mean it's important. You can use white onion as I said before, but I'm using the red one. Now I'm gonna put in roughly about half tablespoon of mixed herb. Remember that the Jamaican herb you know, all right, is, is cooking food, all right? We're gonna put some all-purpose seasoning with one teaspoon of all-purpose seasoning. We're gonna put some oregano in it. Just a little pinch, not much. Some paprika. And also we're going to put some black pepper. Sell off. Now, this is where it comes down to. Alright, and I want you guys to see exactly what I'm talking about. I could use, I got some jerk season right here. I could be using that one. But this is Chef Ricardo natural jerk season when we make because I me make this. Me make these one. I mean know exactly what I'm going on in them. Alright? So they look nice and lovely. Here it is. That's Chef Ricardo natural jerk season. As you can see it for yourself. This is the other one. Look at that. So that look nice. You got everything in it which I need to work with. Alright? If you don't understand what I mean, please go to my YouTube channel and type in Chef Ricardo natural homemade blending season. So basically, here it is. I'm gonna put a tablespoon of the natural jerk season inside of it especially this one i went even hotter i'm gonna put roughly about half tablespoon of this one also inside of it all right for you to make this one the natural jerk season here it is so it look nice and lovely yeah i eat that yeah that's something make it i'm gonna put them down they're nice and lovely if for you to make this one all right here it is again don't play with chef. You might say, why are you using two different ones, chef? It's the same thing. This one is only be a little bit more spicer. But look at this. It's this one more spicer. Hot, hot, hot. Holy pepper, I'm going to put another one there. This one, I didn't make it too hot. Because sometimes I want to make it something and not, not too spicy. Alright? For you to make this, it's on my YouTube channel. All of the ingredients is on my YouTube channel for me, the jerk season. I go on my Instagram page and get the recipe. Don't ask Chef Ricard in the description box. Red flag. Alright. Now, as I can as I can see exactly what I go on about it. I don't need to put a lot of ingredients because the jerk season alone have the flavor. Now we're just gonna simply put the board right. Put back here, so. We're gonna put the ball right on here. This is the jerk season. We're gonna use our hand and simple make it up like this. Alright? You got the flour and everything in it already. You don't need to stress yourself and all these things. What I want you guys to do because as I say we're going to put them in the oven we're now gonna put them on the barbecue grill outside I could go outside and and light up the grill but it is raining at the moment so we don't want to go outside all right so we're going to put them in the oven jerk burger from Chef Ricardo oven style well man you can smell the flavor yeah man Here it is. A lot of people when they make them, they not even put onion. They just put the, bird, the jerk season. No, no, you need to put onion in it. Um, all right. Here it is. A whole pan we can make this now. You can uh, simp. Just roll it up like this. 
you know what I mean? And flap them out. All right. This is the tray which I'm gonna put them on. Yeah, man, I hit this. Look at that. Sell off. All right. If you notice, I didn't put salt in it because you don't know what happened. The all the 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 the, the all-purpose season and the paprika and the water them season have a lot of flavor in it. All right. Hold on then. Sorry. <laughs> Did I put um, all purpose seeds in it? I don't even remember either, to be honest. To be honest, I don't even remember if I didn't put that one in it, but I, I may have to put a little bit of this one in it, all purpose seeds. Roughly about half a tablespoon. That's, that's not gonna, gonna bring in the salt flavor, all right? Anyway, I got a video like this on my YouTube channel, which to show you how to make the jerk burger. Because the most important thing with the jerk burger, right now you don't need to put no salt in this. It doesn't need salt. Because the natural burger has everything in it. Alright, now let's make up the burger. Here it is. That spicy burger or nothing. We are talking about jerk burger. I got a lot of spare pine on this guys. Hot. When we say hot, the hot, hot like a I mean spicy and nice and hot. This is a homemade burger. This is not like yeah, proper homemade burger. This that's a show that one you can do at home in our kitchen if you want to try something different. Because a lot of people like to try different kind of things at home and a lot of people like to cook different things. Wow well, man, you can see me the burger. Honestly, it is amazing. Put that one side again. You know, I'm going to make a whole heap of So I make a few. Sell off Chef Ricardo. Hey, let me tell you something guys. We have a lot of recipe coming out. You see the jerk burger, skeleton and thyme. There's a lot of things you have to put in a jerk sauce when you're making it. A lot of people, you know, they just put pepper and fuel like a bit of this and fuel like a bit of that. That's not jerk burger. Jerk burger, you have to put in all of the ingredients in it and make it come perfect. Alright? So, you know what I mean? Yeah, man. I mean, and an original way of making the jerk burger. In the kitchen with Chef Ricardo. Don't go anywhere. Stay right there and watch this video. This is not a video. Alright. What we're going to do now, we're going to pop this straight in the oven and we're going to be cooking this for roughly about 25 minutes in the oven to get that perfect color and that perfect look. Also, if I was it on the grill, it would be different. You just chuck it on the grill and get the perfect color what you're looking for. All right, guys. We love everyone and all. Thank you so much for watching and tuning into the show. Stay tuned. Tell a friend and a friend tell a friend. Now we're going to put them in the oven for rough about 25 to 30 minutes in the oven. Preheat your oven first. Preheat your oven first. All right. Secondly, we're going to be using electric oven. So you're going to be 165 to 175 or 170 for 20 to 25 minutes. If it's gas mark 6 or 7, Fahrenheit sauce just 355 or 365. Bring it to home, chuck your burger in, jerk burger, and you're good to go. Four jerk burger from Chef Ricardo. Stay tuned. We love everyone on us. Thank you so much. Remember to get the cookbook, because 50% off of the cookbook now, guys. When you need to get to the cookbook, get the cookbook out. It's out right now. Get to the cookbook. 50% off. Burger in the oven. Stay true. The Chef Ricardo. Nice and lovely, guys. So basically, that's the way the burger look. Fantastic and amazing. Alright? So as you can see for yourself, I just take them from the oven and that's the way they come out. I'm telling you. It's amazing. Anyway, to be honest, <laughs> I can't complain. 
You know what I mean? All you have to do is just get yourself some burger bun and all these things. Alright? And make yourself a nice lovely burger. Jerk burger at home from Chef Ricardo today. And um, I'm telling you, you need to try this recipe, guys. Honestly, it is fantastic and an amazing, lovely, the flavor, the taste, and the texture of the lovely beef. That beef jerk burger. Wow, amazing. Thank you so much for tuning into my show. And we have a lot more recipes, a lot more ideas. We'll be coming from Chef Ricardo and the team. Please tell a friend and a friend tell a friend. Beef jerk burger simple recipe effective and nice and just to make sure you guys can see look at this cook to the to the bone let me taste this mm. wow amazing mm. the flavor and the texture of it is amazing wow that is just lovely, nice, and fantastic. Beef, veggie, and all these things, we can make them, guys. Tune in, and I'll see you next time in the kitchen with more recipe from Chef Ricardo and team. See you next time. Bye-bye. Nice one, guys. So basically, as you can see, the jerk burger oh it look look at that that the cheese the jerk burger you know what i mean salad cucumber and tomato look at that fantastic chef ricardo jerk burger is one of the best ever in this world stay tuned please tell a friend and a friend tell a friend we have a lot more recipes and a lot more ideas will be coming from chef ricardo the team jerk burger from chef ricardo cooking show stay tuned with more recipes and more ideas. I respect everyone of you, and I will see you next time at the kitchen with more recipe from Chef Ricardo. See you soon. Bye bye. Yeah, man, it looking good, man.